Alright guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming and today I'm going to talk about this really amazing piece of software that I have used it myself personally to um, recover uh, lost data on my uh, own Android phone before. So um, as you can see on the title, this is the Outphone Android Data Recovery Software and the software that I use and I trust right, to retrieve the files and data from my um, phone itself. So this is one of the most secure software and the software that I have used in a lot of scenarios um, basically because I do a lot of uh, device routing and um, all sorts of things to my Android phone that's why I'm mainly an Android user because there's the, it's like the open source and you know, all this free to use stuff and apps right? Right, and this software is really really good I'm going to show you guys um, um, a few go through about um, how this software works all right? so um, this software is basically um, for any types of Android phones all right? you can see for various scenarios like um, you know, accidental deletion, software update fails, system update failed Alright, um, you've forgotten your password, you know, boot failure, all this and stuff. Alright, that happens to Android system which you cannot get access to your photos and such. Alright, you can use uh, this software right, to recover all of this. I know a lot of photos are very precious to you. Alright, and this stuff not only can recover photos as well, it can recover all the of files, videos, all your WhatsApp messages, all your WeChat messages, everything well, can be recovered easily with this software itself. It's very easy to use. I'm going to show you how you, a, a bit of demonstration later on to show you guys how you guys can be, it can be done. Right, it's very straightforward. All right, and uh, <clears throat> the, the scenarios that you can use this is a lot of scenarios. Right? Sometimes uh, the thing I use this software the most is because sometimes there's a few of photos or what that I deleted it. And in the end, like a few days down the road, I kind of regretted of deleting it. Where I want to recover back, or accidentally I deleted some of the photos that is very important to me. So I just use this software to recover back. All right, so as WhatsApp messages, sometimes if you want to change a new phone, you transfer, and suddenly it doesn't appear. I don't, you don't know why. Maybe the software transferring fail and such, and you. <coughs> And you can use this to basically uh, gain access back to all your data or your WhatsApp chats, you know. There's a Google Drive backup as well. They got a lot of a lot of things and it's compatible with all kinds of phones. As you can see they have support for so many kinds of phones. So basically for any phones that you're using right now, it is definitely compatible. As long as it's an Android phone, alright. <laughs> As you can see, it yeah, supports all this all the way up to Android 5.0, right? Alright, so there's a lot of things you can do, support all kinds of phones, so you don't have to worry about your phone not compatible with it, and it can uh, recover all the files from all different kinds of um, scenarios that you face. So right now, I'm going to um, show you guys a bit of demonstration on the software itself, and go through the software itself on how it generally works. Alright, so um, yeah, so let's get to the software itself, let's go! Alright guys, so this is the software itself, as you can see, it's a very clean and nice software, very nice UI. Uh, easy to navigate, as you can see, you can uh, recover WhatsApp data, Google Drive data, lost data, your WhatsApp business data. Right, this can be very important for businesses as well as recover WeChat data. So, they have so many things for you to recover. Right, um, all your WhatsApp data and your uh, lost file, which these are the two I use the most. Recover WhatsApp data and recover lost data. This is the one I use the most. All right, and um, they have other as well. So let's say, for example, if I want to recover my lost data, I just have to click on this. All right, and I'll show you um, how to um, for the steps or how to enable USB debugging on your device. Um, so I have already enabled my USB debugging. If you don't know how, they have this um, instruction right on the screen itself. So you step by step guide on how you guys can um, um, basically uh, uh, enable it. Right. So so yeah, as you can see, I just have just connected my Z Fold two. So I just connected my phone into it, and as you can see, the, the pop up window came out. Alright, so my phone total storage is almost full. And I just need to allow USB debugging on my computer, and automatically it detects that I allowed it. And as you can see, these are all the file types that I want to recover. So the document, all this. So let's say for example, if I want to recover some of the photos that I deleted, alright, I can just um, deselect all this, and just the photos itself. So I press start. <coughs> so it will run run through my device, and it's just for all kinds of deleted files. So right now it's just getting the data. So um, they have the remaining time here. You can see it only f it only take four minutes. One software that I used about a few a year back, alright. Um, the software probably um, took like one hour or so just to recover it and it's on uh, my old Android device which don't have 256 gig, I think it's about 128 gig, take one hour. So as you can see, they have already um, uh, get back all of my deleted files, deleted images here already. Alright, and I, I deleted quite a lot of photos, alright. 
You know, I have a lot of photos and I deleted a lot of it. Yeah, yeah scanned almost 1,600 plus. All right, we're not gonna let it scan everything because it's gonna take the whole. It's gonna make the video very very long. So we're gonna stop here. We're gonna stop scanning here. Alright, so as you guys can see, okay, of course I have to um blow out some of the images that is um considered private to me. Alright, so um let's just see. Alright, um me and my girlfriend we make cake, alright, all this because um the photo wasn't that good that great. So we I deleted a few because the we took quite a lot. And um and yeah, so I'm um, gonna see. Alright, uh, me and my girlfriend. Some of the photos are just deleted because we got too much of it. And you see all these are deleted photos and <coughs> all, all these are memories as a, basically so um if i want to recover any one of it all right uh we just find one that is okay to recover from this one okay you can just select one or you can select a few you can select all all right select this one you can select two as well all right you can choose to select all all right I just need to select this recover to pc all right you can turn on, you also have this uh, add-on features which is completely free from the subscription that you have purchased so that it can help you enhance the photo. Let's say if the photo that the original photo that you have deleted is blurry, this will help you auto enhance to make it clear using AI. So it's a very nice add-on feature if the photo holds a very important memory to you and you want to make it clearer, you can use this as well. You can select turn on, alright, they will do it for you automatically. So they have been very very nice of them to add on these features for you so that's why i love to use this software so for me i'm not going to do it i'm going to click ok <coughs> you can select where you want it to be i'm just put on my desktop itself all right <coughs> and there you go recover successfully and you can see a file has been created here our phone data recovery on this device data photos and the photos has been successfully recovered into my PC so if I want I can transfer it to my phone if I don't want I'm gonna just delete this away <laughs> all right so yeah so this is how good this thing is connect your phone plug in they will start scan all of your deleted photos recover it which is just a simple click of a button you don't have to root it you don't have to go through all kinds of um, computer science stuff to, to get it done it's very straightforward all right all you have to do is just go back all right, you can recover WhatsApp data as well Right, so we click on start. <coughs> okay, my this device doesn't have um, WhatsApp, anyways. So um, so if you have a WhatsApp installed in your phone, you can use this as well because I'm using WhatsApp Business, All right? And uh, Google Drive data as well. So if you have um, all this backup that you accidentally deleted on Google Drive data, you can um get it back as well as um <coughs> WhatsApp data that is backup in the Google Drive. You can also recover it. So um, yeah, very straightforward. The UI is very simple. You just go follow the process, the steps. Just a click on a button and bam, you get your recovered lost photo. I can do this as a business for, you know, you can um, help people recover files, help a family member recover files as well. This so it's very very easy and straightforward to do. All right, so um, once again, if you guys want to um, get this software, like the link will be in the video description down below. They also have twenty percent off at the moment. You can use it to get a lower price instead. And um, and you can get it for yourself. So all the links will be linked in the video description down below for you to get it. All right, and they're also available for Windows and Mac as well. So if you're a Mac user, you can use this as well. So if you want to get to recover all your files from your Android phones that you had accidentally deleted or due to system crash, all these during software update and such. All right, you can use it as well and support so many kinds of different kind of phone. Basically, all kinds of phone that. Whatever phone that you use, Android phone that you're using right now is able to recover, so you don't have to worry about is this supported or not, this and that. All right, as long as you have an Android phone, you can recover it and you can recover all sort of things, as you have seen in my demonstration, music, videos, messaging, call history, all this and such. They will recover every single one of it for you. So um, <coughs> and every and the recovering process is very fast. That's the thing I like because it saves time and it recovers all the files for you really really quickly. And it's reliable and safe so that's why i'm recommending you guys this software if you guys out there are looking for a software that can help you recover data this is one of the software that i would highly recommend you guys to get it for yourself all right and um <coughs> and with all those add-on features to enhance the photos all this is it's really a bonus and it's really nice of them to add it in as a bonus all right for you to you guys so um once again if you guys want to get check out this software all right um all the links will be in the video description down below for you to so check it out so guys click the first link in the video description down below and it will link you to this site and get this software for yourself so you get a free trial first and if you see your 
See, um, if you like it, you can buy the full version to recover it to your PC. So, so yeah, that's it for today, guys. If you find today's video helpful, leave a thumbs up. If you guys want me to review other software like this, or let me know in the comment section as well. And without further ado, this is JFOS Gaming. I shall see you guys in my next video. Peace out. I don't wanna cry.